Charleston serving up some friendly competition this week. That's right. Young athletes will go head to head for this year's Thunder in the Mountains tennis tournament. So we have Rusty Webb in to tell us all about it. Great to see you, hey, Rusty. Rusty. Hey, great to see you guys, Susan and Tim. Yeah, yeah, thanks for coming in. Yeah, so talk to us about Thunder in the Mountains. Mm -hmm. I always, I love the name. It's a great so, name. how many years have you all been doing this? Um, the teams have been doing it for five years. Mm -hmm. This will be my fourth year as trying to make it, you know, like a, more of an event than just a tournament. So. Yeah. So things are going to be a little different this year, Rusty, because, uh, well, for one. Some of it because of the weather. Some of it because of the weather. Yeah, we've yeah. got, a, you know, remnants of a hurricane coming up. That's, that kind of affects tennis. Describe what's going to be different this year. Right. So um, we're going indoors. Mm -hmm. uh, the YMCA here in Charleston is very, uh, it's been very good to us, very accommodating. And uh, we'll be playing there tomorrow morning at 10, 11.30 and pretty much all through three o'clock for the first two rounds. And then Saturday we'll play there at uh, 11 a.m. for the semifinals. And then Sunday we'll play at 10 a.m. Uh, for the final match. We have changed the format this year. Oh. It is going to be a women's open singles tennis tournament mm. with a cash purse. Um, so the winner receives uh, $1,000, the runner up, uh, $500 and the two semifinalists will receive $250. Nice. And we're including high school students, but the high school students are not eligible for cash prizes. That's so they can play, they just can't get, yeah, they can't get paid. Well, it gives them something and to look have, forward to. We have, yeah, we have players coming in as far away from New Jersey and Maryland. We have some, two high school students that are coming in that are pretty good players from other states. And we have our own uh, players here. We have a player from Morgantown who won the AAA uh, Girls Championship just this past May. Mm -hmm. And then we have our own here in Charleston, uh, if you know the, the Orcutt girls, okay. Nadia is going to play in it. Wow. And she's a rock star, as is her sister. And they're going to be uh, teeing it up against uh, uh, college players. Marshall and WVU will be, of course, our anchor schools. Uh, we weren't able to get any other colleges, I think, because we started a little late. Mm -hmm. But we hope to get UC and State involved next year. Yeah. And we hope to go to 60, 64, if not 32 players. So oh, we're starting great. small, starting again. And then we're going to build it back up like we did uh, Thunder in the Mountains. Yeah, it, it's, been, it's been so successful yeah. in the past. And I know the pandemic obviously interfered mm -hmm. with a, a, a lot of people's plans. Mm -hmm. But this is really good. Uh, no matter how it's done. This is really good for the, the city of Charleston and really the whole valley, the Kanawha Valley. Mm -hmm. And I can't beg coaches enough to bring your middle school, oh, your yeah. high school teams, boys, girls. You're just not going to see this caliber of tennis unless you go to the closest place would be the Western and Southern Professional Tournament, mm -hmm. which is in Cincinnati in August. Mm -hmm. You're, you know, you're you don't have to go far to see really good tennis. And what, if, you, if you're familiar with the YMCA, you know that you're kind of in one corner up in a crow's nest watching. We're gonna have chairs right on the courts, oh, on courts wow. one and five, and we're gonna play on courts two, three, and four. So you're gonna be sitting right there uh, watching it with you know, 25 yards from you, if not, if not closer. And uh, you just can't beat beat no. that the visuals. Yeah, you know, when you were access. describing this, and I thought that as well. I thought, yeah, every middle school mm -hmm. tennis player needs to come out to see this. That's They're how you learn. See it. Yeah. yeah, that's yeah. how you learn. So uh, very inspiring for all these future players, mm -hmm. as well as yeah. of course the ones that will be there. How can people attend? Say maybe some of these young uh, young uh, beginning players it's want to come watch. It's free. It's all free. Just show up. Oh, Just come to the wine, it's free. Yeah. You can't beat that. No. Um, the city has been a great... That's about great. It. Uh, Rusty at RustyWeb.com or you can go to UTR, which is, our, which, is the, you know, which is the group that is actually conducting, you know, the actual tournament. Okay. Uh, 
That's great. Everybody That's knows how to find me. Yeah, they do. <laughs> that you're is right. true. Yes, you are very. <laughs> and I think for the next couple of days, we definitely know where you're going to yeah. be. So. <laughs> That's true. Yes. Yeah. Thank you so much for yeah. doing this event year after Absolutely, year. Absolutely. Yeah. And uh, stopping by to let everybody yeah. know about it. Yeah. Thanks, Rusty. I appreciate it. Uh, good to see you both of you. Yeah. yeah. Thank good you. Good seeing you too. Have fun this weekend. <laughs> that's for sure.